Welcome back to The Sims 4 Cottage Living of Rags to Riches. Today, we're finally gonna move Hazel in. And if you forgot who Hazel was, which quite frankly, you shouldn't have, uh, that is currently Trenton's love interest. And she was the main character in the Dream Home Decorator series, which has since finished. If you didn't see the final episode, it, it was a mess. It was, <laughs> nothing went right. It was actually honestly really funny. So I suggest watching it if you haven't. But we're gonna invite Hazel, well actually, you know what? It's 9 p.m. Let let's maybe wait till the morning. Uh, and see how we go. Now, I was also working on the handiness aspiration slightly, wasn't it? Was it th is it this one, the nerd brain? Yeah, so this one allows us to upgrade any object instantly. And as a comment mentioned, if we do complete this aspiration and get this reward trade of instant upgrades, you don't actually need upgrade parts for the instant upgrades. So that means we could instantly upgrade a coop to have the automatic feeding which is amazing because getting the animal shed upgrade parts is like the hardest part. But if we can do this, that'd be that'd be great. I mean, it's still not easy. We still have to go through this whole uh, aspiration, but I think it's a nice route to take. So Trenton, I'm gonna get you to go join the game. I guess you may as well. Uh, everything else, oh, I guess I need to do some planting. I'll, I'll plant in the morning. We'll, we'll worry about the morning. It's late at night right now. Oh, uh, okay, fine. Chazzy, go take care of Caltrain. No, no, it is Caltrain, okay. Oh, so yeah, I'm getting confused by which, if we got Kowleen or Kaltrina. I don't know. <laughs> Let's go take care of them. It is like 10 p.m., but we're gonna take care of them. And you keep playing. So yeah, if we get them leveled up through Nerd Brain, oh, Cowplant. Yeah, yeah. If we get them leveled up through Nerd Brain, that'll be great. The Cowplant's offering cake. Hmm. I wonder if I should eat it. No, I should probably just go feed you. Ah, oh, Logic level five. Cool. So once it gets to level six then he'll be good. Now, do we have, what's our food situation like? Yeah, so the, the other suggestion was, you know, last part we tried to open a grocery store. Unfortunately, our oversized produce only sells with seven simoleons, which is just, we do, it's just not practical. We can't do that because we get, what, how many crops out of this? 72, actually more than that. That's how many we plant, but we get more than 72 each harvest. And you have to sell them one by one and we'd only get seven simoleons per thing. So that doesn't make any sense. The suggestion was that we can make pies Where's that comment? It was a good comment. Okay, yeah, you should have the store sell pies, jams, animal treats, hazels, paintings, and other craftables, then just sell produce to Kim. Then you can still run the store that's more like a town gift shop, which would be super fitting in that location anyways. So thank you. That's a great suggestion. That's what we're gonna do instead of trying to do the, the grocery store kind of thing. I love the idea of the grocery store. Don't get me wrong. I would do it if we could, but it just ain't gonna work. So we're gonna have to pivot, pivot and uh, try a different idea. Anyway, we'll we'll get to that in time. All right, we're nearly level six here, which is great. That'll take us to the next level. There we go. Uh, oh, we're gonna own a rocket ship. Okay, hang on. Those, aren't those like five grand? Hang on, rocket. Yeah, five grand just to buy it. Okay. Oh, the other good news is if we have Hazel moving, which we're gonna do today, gonna get Trenton to go to sleep now. Once, that'll be good because because she's a kleptomaniac. As long if she moves in, she's not gonna steal the stuff from our farm, so. That's good. We don't need to worry about us stealing stuff then. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, I thought Chaz was supposed to also be sleeping. There we go. All right, so we're both asleep. All right, Chaz is up for the day. Let's go tend to these chickens because it seems like they were out and about. Let's clean the coop and collect the eggs. Uh, yeah, slightly dirty. That's all right. How, do we have any more cowberries? That's the question. Oh, wait, what are you doing up? Oh, you came down here to smell something? Oh, actually, you're in a pretty good mood. So let's, um, well, let's invite Hazel around. I'm just gonna get you to go here for a second. Invite to hang out the current lot. Now, there's been a lot of suggestions. I think we're going to have to do renovations to the house with Hazel moving in. I'm not going to do that this episode, so I'll let you in the comments down below on this episode. Let me know what changes we should make. Uh, namely, I mean, the house is pretty... Well, it's not even fully furnished. We need to do something about that. Uh, there's been suggestions of, like, a separate house, I think, as well, or, like, some extensions, or, like, a workshop for Hazel as well, because, obviously, she loves photography and painting and all that kind of stuff and interior decorating, and maybe she needs an office to work from as well. So, I, I mean, let me know in the comments down below how you think we should renovate this lot to incorporate Hazel as well. But for now... Uh, excuse me? Why are you going inside? I didn't let you in. <laughs> anyway, so I'll get them to say hi. You've collected the eggs. Get you to go take care of these guys real quick as well. Oh yeah, so I, I forgot I have a mod at the moment that um, disables trees like fading away when I zoom in because because I've been taking a lot of screenshots for Sims Guesser that I made and if you haven't seen it, that's up here. Really cool little game that I made that you can play on my website. Uh, I, I had to get that mod so trees stop fading away when I was taking screenshots like really close, but it means <laughs> trying to see the chicken island, there's trees kind of in the way. 
But, you know, anyway, whatever. All right, let's collect the eggs there. Uh, no, no, don't call them out. That was a mistake. And then, do we, oh, it's actually clean. All right, well, I'll scatter some feed as well, so they get plenty. Back over to you guys. Hey, Hazel. I'm just gonna make sure she's not stealing anything from me. She made girlfriend yet or not? I think we're just, what, what are we? Sweethearts. Okay, we're not even, not official yet. Let's ask to be girlfriend. Apparently she, I think she asked. I saw a comment saying that she had asked last episode or something and I, I ignored it or I missed it. I don't know. I didn't do that on purpose. So, there we go. Oh, look at that. We're official. Yeah! Well, we should, maybe we should take her somewhere special. Do I have restaurants in my world? I know restaurants are buggy, but I feel like we should take her on a date or something, you know? How do I, how do I do the date thing again? I always forget. Ask on date. Will it work if she's here? Oh yeah, cool. And then, ah, oh, Summerfest. And then we'll pop the question. Hmm, we could go to GeekCon. Oh, there's a cafe. The Boathole Cafe. That's a potential. Maybe somewhere in the old city? No, these places suck. <laughs> uh, Brindleton Bay, maybe? Hmm. Maybe the big city. See, I don't really have any restaurants in my game because restaurants kind of suck. We have Snooze here. We could go to Snooze or I think maybe Newcrest surely has one, maybe. Oh no, I replaced all of Newcrest with Delhi's Newcrest at one point. Uh, Oasis Springs? No. <laughs> Willow Creek? Okay, I literally have one restaurant in my game and it's the one in Magnolia Promenade. Let's go to Snooze. Ah, beautiful weather. Oh, yeah, so Snooze is the restaurant where you have to wear your pajamas to it. That's, <laughs> that's the dress code. All right, let's go request a table. I feel like Hazel's not in the proper attire. What? Don't... Do we have to sit outside? Can we sit inside, please? I reckon this is a pretty cool restaurant in the end. Like, look at these tables. Aren't they fun? The weather's not fantastic, but... Uh, did someone make a mess up here? Yeah. All right, where are we going? Oh, no. We're going to an outside table. Can we just have... Really? Do we... Can we have an inside table? Okay, she just walked through the wall. Here's your table. Um, do, do you mind if we sit inside? No, no, we're fully booked. There's no one there. No, no, they're all booked. Sorry. <laughs> okay, well, we'll just sit right here. <laughs> Pretty much in the rain. Okay, so what I have to do? Socialize with my date. That makes sense. Funny. Okay, let's maybe not start there. Uh, romance, be enticing. Oh, she's got a future cube. So, Hazel, I've been thinking, you know, we've been seeing each other for like a couple days. Um, have you ever, have you thought about Moving in, getting away from the big city. I know you just tried to get a bunch of roommates to uh, to live with you. How did that go? Not well? Yeah, yeah, I didn't think so. Uh, I'm just not seeing an option to ask you to move in with me. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> okay, what if it's able? Oops. Okay, so I'm gonna have, wait, what time is it? 11 a.m. I'm gonna have a coffee. Wait, oh, yeah, for Trenton, he can have a coffee. Hazel is gonna have an orange juice and then the appetizer. None, because I mean, we're kind of having breakfast, so it doesn't really make Okay, hang on. None of these meals are really breakfast themed. <laughs> cheese pizza. Hot dog. Okay, what's the most breakfasty thing here? Maybe a grilled cheese? I have grilled cheese for breakfast sometimes. Cool. 18 bucks. Oh, chuck chip cookie. Hazel? Oh, Hazel's just doing push ups over there. Okay. <laughs> uh, Hazel? Um, hey guys, what's going on? Oh, you're, you're here to take my order. Okay, well, what are you doing here then? Are you just here to watch? <laughs> it's like, you're here to take my water, what are you doing? Okay, we'll bring it out as soon as possible. Did she just run away scared? She- Oh my god, you just got struck by lightning! <laughs> Wait, aren't you supposed to be in the kitchen making our food? Is that our food burning? Uh, chefs? Hello? Alright, well, this is the, uh, the restaurant experience- Okay, why am I not sitting at my table? Sit together. Order for table. We already ordered. Alright, well, let's just be friendly. And a thing about gardening, because that's what I love to do. Look at this. Isn't this beautiful? Memory erase? Hmm. That seems like a bad idea. Would that ruin our relationship? Now, she she does like mischief, so... Give her some fake bad news. Classic. Ah, got you! Oh, hey! It's James Turner. There he is. A mad scientist. Why are there so many people running for fear of their lives out here? <laughs> Look at him. Look at him go. Ah! What are you doing, dude? Alright, how are you guys going? Honestly, just trying to see if I can ask you to move in, but I think probably... Need to not be sitting down at a restaurant. I am, oh my gosh. This dripping wet singed chef is making our food. That doesn't seem like it's a good idea. Oh yeah, food, wait, it actually showed up. Hang on, oh yeah, there you go. Eat grilled cheese sandwich, drink, thank you. Oh, and now she's running inside scared. Yeah, how do you think we feel? You sat us outside. You sat us in the storm. Wait, why is everyone being sat outside? Use these tables, there's like four tables inside that are empty. Five, including this one down here. Oh, here comes someone else scared. Alright, how's the grilled cheese? Is it actually good though? Or is it crap? 
Quality normal. Eh, average. <laughs> I have a deep conversation with my date. Okay, well, let's do that. I can do that. Oi, let's be deep. Yeah. <laughs> Just watching everyone, like, run past and come inside. 10 out of 10. I had a perfect uh, date. Socialize about meal. Uh, under friendly, discuss food. Oh, okay. Um, uh, I'm not seeing it, to be honest. Maybe because she, she hasn't eaten hers. We can't talk about it. This is under friendly. It's not there. Uh, it's not there. Not there. Oh, what are we talking about? All right, are we done here now? Oh, uh, where are you going? Just over there. Oh, hey, Colin. Um, all right, well, let's end. I'm going to end the meal. Let me just pay. Okay, so we finished here. That's good. Now, Hazel. Wait, wait, there she is. Can I ask you... Ah, oh, passionate kiss. Well, should we get some more... Pro... Should we get something that's not, like, gonna kill us? <laughs> can we go... Wait, didn't we have a bar up here? Oh, no, we just turned it to a cafe that we don't really use. Well, can we go... Oh, I can't sit... I... Oh, okay, well, we can't be here. Let's, um... Oh, I know where we can go. Oh, wait, we can't travel because we're still on a date. Right, okay. Yeah, let's end early. So gold level reward. Okay, that's fine. All right, now let's travel. Look, I just don't want to go home to... Chaz, like, it seems a little awkward. So we're gonna go to the store and we're gonna tell Hazel our big plan. We're like, look, uh, Chaz and I, we just bought this store and we thought we'd turn it into like a little gift shop and we would love for you to join us on this venture. Um, we'd love for you to, uh, you know, contribute your artwork and photography, you know? Go here together. Check out our store, Hazel, we got this for you. I should probably pick up all these watermelons and sell them to Kim, actually. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, is it, is it that stinky in here? Hello! No, look, let me propose you join our venture. Would you like to join Ricks and Co? Actually, did you guys have name suggestions? I know I did ask for them, but I didn't actually... <laughs> frog Emporium, forget selling produce. Chaz is an animal lover and should have a frog store. <laughs> mm. uh, I'm not sure about names. Oh, well, you can keep suggesting names uh, in this comment as well. All right, Hazel, do you want to join the Ricks and Co family and move in with me on the farm? Leave the city behind? Okay. Oh, yeah, we get Hagrid too. Yeah. Wait. Oh, yeah. Sell lot and furnishings too. Um, yes. Oh, oh, 148. Okay. So she has moved in and we did get all that money, but we're actually going to buy her old place. Uh, oh, actually, I guess I should. Hang on. Manage worlds. Saving it to manage worlds. So what we're going to do. So the idea is that she still owns those three houses. Um, and we're gonna pretend that she's renting them out, but I'm just gonna turn it into like, I guess a retail store and we'll just own it. Or should we turn it into, cause that, you can say that's what I did here so we could own it as well. Maybe we, we could turn it into something else that we could actually use. Like, well, either, it either, has, either has to be a restaurant or uh, a vet clinic. So yeah, this is Hazel's place. She lived here. These two are rent, well, were rented out. Um, but now we'll turn it into, we just do, I'll just do retail for now, and then you can let me know if you have any ideas. Like, we could make it a vet clinic, potentially, or even even a restaurant. Just so we have another restaurant, maybe turn one of the houses into a restaurant that we could come and visit sometimes, you know? I don't know. There's some ideas, but you can let me know. I'll just put this in there. It's fine. It doesn't actually need to be a useful lot. Like, we don't actually need to use it as a retail store. <laughs> what is this? I was just looking at the empty households in the world, because there was a comment about... Um, the the error, the error that popped up last time when we were traveling is something about empty households being created and their foxes. I, so I guess this is a fox. I don't know. I'm just going to get rid of it. That looks glitchy. I only seem to have two of them. Sca Skags. <gasps> it's a sign. That was why Wale well, Skags his name. Maybe he's reincarnated. Oh, well, let's delete it. Um, there only seems to be two. So I don't think the bug that we got last time is too bad. But um, anyway. All right, so now what we're going to do, we're going to use that $148,000 we just got to buy a retail store, which is really just her old house because you can't buy residential lots, unfortunately. Really wish I would add that. I don't know why you can't own multiple homes yet and, and, and like be a landlord. That'd be like perfect. Yeah, so I'm going to purchase that as furniture. We have $6,000 left, which is pretty much exactly right. And here we go. Uh, I'm not going to transfer any money to the business because it doesn't need any money. <sighs> home sweet home. Oh, there goes the robot. Actually, is there anything we want to take from here? We probably should. Um, well, I don't want to take... Okay, well, I don't know. What do we actually need? So there's like upgraded beds and stuff and computers. Like there's expensive computers here. The thing is, I don't think... Do we pay bills on these retail lots if we're not on them? I feel like they just stay here and they don't do it like that. We're not going to get charged for them. Um, 
I feel like we should take this, but I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> Let's get all this stolen stuff. Woodworking table, we have one of those. Um, okay, I don't know. Well, we can always come back because we do technically own all this stuff. Well, not technically, we do own it. Uh, cool. Oh, look at this little happy family down here. Hazel, Trenton, Chaz, Feifei, and Hagrid. <laughs> That's great. Alrighty, so for now, Hazel and Chaz, oh, Hazel and Chaz, no, Hazel and Trenton will share this bed there. I'm just gonna sign it so she knows to actually sleep there. I am gonna purchase a whole bunch of produce because I think, I know we planted the aubergines. I don't think, I, I didn't buy any more than that, did I? Oh wait, no, I did. I got watermelons and mushrooms already. Okay, I'm gonna plant all this stuff now. Yeah, there we go. That was great. Oh, damn it, the last one just got placed in my inventory. All right, so I planted the entire thing. Oh, oh no, that is good. And thankfully it actually just started raining, so we don't even need to water them. Also the golden chickens are going around and pulsing all of them too, which is fantastic. Uh, yeah, look at that. Oh, yeah. Now that is what I call a golden pulse. <laughs> okay, so these ones have all disappeared. I think it's whenever there's like a chicken or something on it or like a rabbit. They seem to just pop off into the inventory. Wait, what have I got here? I've got pumpkin. Wait, what's this? That's aubergine. I have two lettuce, which I think was supposed to go here. And then the pumpkin. Whoops, whoops. Nope. Hmm. I think there's this stuff there. Solve and move objects on. All right, cool. Okay, so that should be all that. Uh, looking good. How's the... No, that's Hazel. Oops. How's this going? How's this going? Collect the eggs and clean the coop. You need to... Hey, Hazel, actually, can you go... Now that I've got a third sim here. Hazel... Hey, hey, no, I'm just trying to click on her. <laughs> okay, go feed that. And Trenton, go uh, collect eggs and clean the coop. How's the food going? We've actually got two dogs now, so we probably need some more food. So maybe let's uh, sort that out. Let's get a second bowl right about here. This one can be red. There you go. And then Hazel can go fill up this. Schedule that's six hours. Okay, I guess we'll do the same on this one. Yeah. So I'm going to say call Hagrid to eat and then fill that one. And then fill Hazel and then fill Hazel. Yeah, there you go. And then call Fei Fei to eat. There you go. Hopefully Fei Fei and Hagrid. Oh, Fei Fei's right there. So hopefully Fei Fei and Hagrid become great friends. Or more. <laughs> yeah. All right. So you guys, I think you don't have a bunch of eggs in the inventory. I should probably get those out before they all go off. Now, there's also been a suggestion to get a third chicken coop for regular chickens so we can get regular eggs. And I agree with that. I think I want to wait until Trenton has the instant upgrade ability so that we can add the auto feeder, the age extender, all that kind of stuff that just makes it easier to manage more chickens. Because right now I'm already forgetting to feed these guys. But I'm going to buy the rocket ship because that's five grand. I guess I can just go out here by the... Put it out the back by, <laughs> by the wind turbines. That seems to make sense to me. Now the cool thing is... So I get you to go... Okay, well, apparently, is it because this grass stuff's in the way? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to put it there instead. Huh. Okay, now I can shift click on it, but I can't regular click on it. Interesting. All right, never mind. I'll sort that out later. <laughs> I was, I was going to do that now. Um, all right, so Chaz, pretty good. So all this is planted. So yeah, this set here is the ones that I would like to super vitality. So I'm going to get those to Chaz. I'm going to get Chaz to come out here and say fertilize. Oh, that's trying to... Sorry, Chaz to come out here and say fertilize the super vitality. Because I want this plot of 12 to be the massive oversized ones of all of them. We're going to try our hardest to fertilize these like every day. And the golden pulsing is happening on them too, which is great. The thing is we have a good supply of super vitality at the moment. Because uh, we haven't really been using any fertilizer at all for a while. So it's kind of just built up. But it's not going to last very long, obviously. All right, so all of these are now super vitality. Uh, ten. I can't do any encouraged growth yet. I think that has to be wait till the next stage. That's okay. So then I'm going to open up this. I'm going to grab all the valuable eggs and... No, I'm not. Never mind. Because it's 9 p.m. We'll go in the morning. I was like, we're going to go to the retail. We'll go to the grocery store. Collect all that stuff there. Oh, hey, Vlad. We collect all that stuff there. And then... Oh, yeah. Let's go give a treat. And then um, we'll go sell it to Kim. Like, we'll get the watermelons and stuff out of the... Uh, the store. Now Hazel, you can go sleep with uh, Trenton and I do just mean, oh yeah, become friends with um, Hagrid. I do just mean sleep. No funny business, okay? Yep. Okay, who left this out here? We have a limited supply of food here on the farm, okay? I, why do I always have a puddle in the middle of the kitchen? I, I actually don't understand. Is it from the dogs? Also, this robot is supposed to like clean up uh, puddles too. Ah, oh, becoming companions with Feifei. Yeah. 
Now, oh, you're still scared of fireplaces. It's okay. I'll calm Hagrid down. I'll take care of you. Do you wonder if that counts as friendly stuff with animals? It's okay, Faith. Oh, Faith, Faith. Hagrid. I'm gonna get them confused so much now. Um, get to know him. It's okay, I know I need a pee-pee, but we'll go pee-pee later. Now, how do I get the dogs to, like, get it on? <laughs> so we can get puppies, because that'd be epic. Uh, here, I'll put out the fire, because Hagrid is not a big fan of it, so I'll just put that out. All right, well, Chaz is tired too. Actually, Chaz needs to go to the toilet. Let's go to the toilet and then go to sleep. <gasps> we got the second cow plant. Yeah, look, now they're guarding the evil chickens. I swear rabbits don't do stuff half the time. Look, they're just like sitting in the open. I don't know what they're doing. All right, Trenton's up. Can you work on the rocket yet? Why can't I click on this? I don't understand. What did I do? Hang on, reset. Re- hmm. Did I like mess something up? Hang on, let me turn. Do I have move objects on? Move objects off. Let me pl let me just place it down again. So they're like here, okay? Hmm. It just doesn't seem to- Hmm. I would like to launch or upgrade a rocket five times, but I don't seem to be able to interact with it. Maybe when we travel and come back, it will start working. I don't know. Who left this out? It's gone off now. Because I, I want him to I want him to get the instant upgrade. I, I want that to happen. All right, well, I'll get Trenton to collect everything then. Let's get Trenton to collect all the eggs and um, we'll go sell it all to Kim and get a bit of cash. Maybe we don't have enough money to start the rocket because I'm pretty sure you need to spend 2,500 to start building the rocket. So maybe it's just not even showing me the option until I have the money. Maybe that's the problem, so. We're gonna go with that. Right, so here we are just gonna basically, can I just, oh, no, I might have to, right? Wait, hang on, toggle, first of all, for sale tag. Can I just take them to my inventory? Like, is that now? Okay, I think I can just drag them. I don't think I have to set them not for sale, thankfully. Oh, look how dirty it is as well. It's so filthy already. I wonder if the eggs would sell for a lot of money here. Like, maybe we could sell eggs instead. Maybe it's just the produce. We could test the eggs. All right, so I've collected everything. Now, uh, let me go clear the signs as well of the sold stuff, just so those aren't there. I am, I'm interested. Let's try selling this egg. <laughs> just the one egg. And let's say, set for sale. All right, store is open. Come on, come on, get your golden egg. Only available here at Ricks and Co. Gro oh yeah, Column's here. All right, great customer. Hey guys, welcome. Yeah, we got a golden egg. It's pretty exciting. Uh, let me just hide those tags so we can actually see them. I like how we have two staff members here. Oh, everyone's here. Agnes and Agatha. They're probably coming to shop for their own store. Oh, can we, pl I please want to sell it to Agnes Grubble Bottom. Can I like click on her and be like, for you, the price is triple the time. Triple the price. Triple the time? What am I talking about? I also have $6,000 in this business. I should probably take that out. I don't think we need that much money in here. <laughs> Give me that. Give me that money back. There we go. <laughs> you want to hear a real secret? I find you just stay. Okay, get out of my store. Get out of here. Get, how do I, get, how do I, get out. <laughs> I don't know how to kick you out of my store. Fine, you can say. I kind of need to have a shower, which thankfully, hey! Oh, no, what the heck? I thought this was locked for employees. Oh, wait, yeah, if it's locked for, hang on. Who is it locked for? I thought employees can only go into here and this area and like the bathroom. All right, hang on. All right, well, look, even if it was unlocked for an employee, I think someone working in my store should know they're not supposed to have a bath at work. Criticize. Hang on, go criticize her. What the heck is going on? No having baths on work time. What the heck? Lock you off for everyone but household members. What makes you think you can have a bath at work? What is wrong with you? Now you're on your phone. What are you doing? Criticize. Hang on. Hang on, I gotta get out of the bath. Get off your phone and get back to work. Jeez. Okay, go do your job, please. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Oh, yes. Okay, Colum is like the worst employee ever. All right, reading up customer. Let's see if we get more than five bucks for this golden egg. All righty, so you want to buy the one golden egg we have? It's hatchable too, so you could actually hatch your own golden chicken from this and put us out of business as the only golden chicken uh, store in town. Four fifty, yeah. Okay, so we can sell golden eggs for reference. Uh, let's close the store and remove the sign. So we paid ninety-three dollars to Colum for working today for some reason. I don't know why we paid it that much, but uh, there you go. Also, why is this not open? Oh, it's like literally opening now. Okay, cool. Hopefully the stuff in my inventory hasn't gone off because it's been in there for a while, right? Hey, Kim. Are you crazy? Oh, dang it. All right, fine. <laughs> fine. I don't care. All right, so we're going to be selling today our golden eggs and our obsidian eggs, our aubergines and our watermelons and $4,500. Not bad. Not too shabby. All righty, let's go back home. What the heck are you wearing? Did I put this on you? I don't... <laughs> I don't remember this outfit. Did I do this last episode and I already forgot about it? I, I don't know. All right. Wait, I still can't click on this. Why? Why can't I click on this? Can't click on rocket launch pad Sims 4. 
Oh, great. So rockets are just bugged at the moment. Oh, are you kidding? Like, there's like this whole thread of seven pages of people having the same issue. Cool. So, <laughs> dang it, that was my plan to do this. Launch or upgrade a rocket five times. Do any of my sims have rockets? Because it doesn't say I have to build a rocket. Just need to launch one. GeekCon was in town, but we have since missed that. I don't think that exists anymore. I'm trying to think. Do any of my sims have a rocket in this save game? <gasps> There's one. Isn't there one in the rooftop here? <gasps> yes, I see it. I see it. <laughs> this is not my fault that we have to go to extreme. Oh no, this is going to be. Oh, hey, Grim. <laughs> I always forget Grim lives here. It's not my fault that I have to come here. Which is the front door? Hello? How do I? Hello? How do I get in the house? Like, I know that door's locked, but I thought I could like knock on the door. Hmm, I might have to switch households because <laughs> the rocket's up here. See, I can't click on it here. Oh, travel through. <gasps> we could go to six them. Hmm. Wait, where is the robot? Because the robot's the one that uh, lives here. Wait, I think I saw. Hello? Oh, there. Oh my gosh. Looks so angry. Hello? Can I talk to you, please? Hey, man. Oh, we're going upstairs. Okay. Hey, man. Oh, yeah. Look at this renovation Hazel did here. So good. Do we have to stand here? I guess because I can't get in the door. All right, I feel like I should have to become friends with, with the robot. And then I'll just load into the tower and unlock the doors because otherwise I can't get to the rocket. <laughs> yeah, I'll empathize with you with my alien powers and analyze your personality. Oh my gosh, wait, I didn't even think about it because Trenton is an alien. We could actually um, travel through the wormhole, go to his home planet. Oh, it's coming full circle. I would like to have built our own, but obviously we can't seem to do that at the moment. Actually, we should probably not cloud gaze. Hang on, you're a robot and it's raining. I don't know if you got the waterproof upgrade. All right, uh, how are you going? Are we like friends yet or something? Or like, what are we? Current, okay, we're a friend. Okay, so what I'm going to do is go to the world, say I'm going to manage world. I'm going to load into this lot and I need to unlock the doors because we specifically locked them all when we were playing on this lot. Oh, also that window there is glitched, which is a slight problem that they're all locked because that means whenever we did renovations and stuff, I couldn't get in the house. Okay, so, well, let's, let's use this cheat, which is hopefully work. It, it's unlocked through using a mod. Um, I don't know if that actually does anything. Oh yeah, it does. Look, the door's not locked anymore. Fantastic. I probably could have done it when I was in the other family anyway now that I think about it, but anyway. Now the front door, I will set that as a front door. I don't know which door was the front door. That one is now. So all the doors should be unlocked. We should be able to let ourselves up to the roof, which is good. So let's swap back over to Trenton. Oh, okay. I'm apparently just in here now anyway. <laughs> okay. So now, oh, look at all this science stuff that we can use now. The cloner. Oh man, this stuff is so cool. All right, well, let's go. Oh, I can upgrade it and everything. Oh, I'm a high enough skill. Well, let's, should we travel through? No, let's, let's explore space. Is this, I need a launcher upgrade a rocket five times. So let's just hang out. Let's just do those. And then we can go to six them. Let's board the ship. I'm not going to go through. We did all this rocket stuff before. If we were building this on our farm, I'd probably put more time into like looking through all this stuff, but uh, I figure we might as well just jump through it all. There you go. There's one. I like it. You know how in Sims when you go to someone's house and you cook in their kitchen or like nap in their bed and they're like, hey, that's super inappropriate. Get out. No, it's fine. I can fly their rocket ship. That's cool. <laughs> I can take off into space and they're fine with that. So I don't know. I don't know what's what, you know. We're also level three of rocket science. So there you go. Look at that. I can also change the weather. Cool. All right, let's go up. That's two. This is working pretty well, to be honest. Uh, that's three. Let's go back up again. Uh, good old Brychester. Nice and rainy. Look at this place. Hey, level four. I can build an upgrade faster. Fantastic. <laughs> All right, the last trip. Five. Wait, actually, what, what do I have to do after this? Nerd brain. Achieve level 10 logic. Fixer upgrade five objects. Okay, that's pretty easy. Well, this is probably the last time I'll use a rocket ship. So let's travel to six of them. Let's go. Let's go meet my mom. Okay, I thought this was going to be like, hey, do you want to go to Six Sim? It's like, no, if the robot's just like, mm, do I like video gaming? Yeah, okay. Here we go. Beam down. Oh, good old Six Sim. I don't really know the point of this. I mean, it's cool. And well, the point is you get a few extra things. Like if we collect some of this stuff, it's unique. And we see aliens here. Let's see if my mom's here. Who's my mom again? Senior pollination technician number three. I don't think they actually exist. Like, I don't think they'll actually show up. I wish I could invite them to hang out. Oh yeah, there's no phone service here. That makes sense. We're on a different planet. <laughs> oh, let's take a cutting of this. Heck yeah. Might as well explore all the stuff here. What's this thing? Oh, let's click that. Look at this. Look at this place. It's beautiful. It's pretty cool. Like, it visually pretty cool. Uh, other than that, it's kind of... There's not really anything to do here. Like, look at this weird alien waterfall. Isn't that sick? 
By the way, keep in mind, Sixum, because it's now added to Sims Guesser. If you play Sims Guesser, you might get a location in Sixum. <gasps> Mom? You guys are just regular people! I thought there were supposed to be aliens here! What the heck is this? <laughs> These are just regular townies, what the hell? Where? Where's the aliens? Mom? Are you here? Go harvest this thing. Harvest quill for it, let's go get it. Can I swim? Oh, you know what? They should make this world swimmable. Imagine just swimming around this weird alien goo and it should give you like some buff or something. Oh, look at this. A few orb socks. Let me take a cutting of it. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with all this stuff, but I'm taking it. Oh, yeah. So what is this thing? I I've just been collecting it, but I don't know what it is. So this circle, unpolished geode. Oh, okay. The geode that sits there. What's, what's this? Uproot. Oh, wait, no. Uproot just destroys them. I always forget about that. Oh, okay. I just dumped it. <laughs> Another geode there. Okay. All right, are there any aliens now or is it just random townies? Are we going to see Agnes crumple bottom here? Like, what the heck is this? Like, the d <laughs> there's people in Santa outfits. Like, okay, I get it. It's Summerfest, but we're on another planet. Why Why is there a teen celebrity B-lister here in a freaking Christmas outfit? I was hoping to meet my mom. <laughs> I was gonna collect some stuff, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Well, that seems like another thing that they can add to the... the uh, just another random sim. Are any of them here aliens? Or are they all just regular people? I thought it was coming to meet my kind. I found an alien. Really? Oh, this is a slug. Cool. Um, well, I guess while I'm here, I might as well remove my disguise, right? Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Look, I'm home. Yay! Hi. Are you an alien? You must be, because you're on another planet. There's no other way you could have gotten here, so... Hi. <laughs> so um, I am actually kind of hungry, so I'm gonna eat a perfect dragon fruit. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking to you now, because why are you even here? <gasps> oh, that's a robot! What the heck? Well, I guess that's... At least that's more plausible. <laughs> Where? Okay, where's Bob and Eliza Pancakes? That's that's who I expect to see next. Hello? Oh, there's someone... Oh, no, just another sim. <laughs> All right, well, should we go home? There's literally no point in me being here right now. <laughs> Like I said, six of them, pretty, pretty pointless. Especially when there's not even any aliens here. I don't know what to say. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, why am I home? Oh, okay, good. I did actually level up in my, my thing anyway. Oh, no. Don't let Hazel see my true form. Ah, <sighs> that's better. All right. What the heck is this? What is this? A moral mushroom. It's just floating here. Okay. Oh, there's two of them. Wait, what's this? An onion? And I'll eat it. Cool. <laughs> What if I can use this now? Nah, still can't use it. The rockets are just bugged. So we spent five grand on that. I mean, I guess I, I'm fine just selling it. We got plenty of money anyway. How much do I lose? I lose a thousand dollars. I mean, I could just cheat that money back, I guess, but I don't really care, so whatever. All right, let's take a shower. Have you and Hazel ever woohooed? Not that you have to, but I don't recall. Um, you're all the way, oh, you're doing some weeding. Cool, hang on. Actually, I need you to go, oh, it's so dark. Can you go to these guys and do encourage crop growth? like? I just want you to do this set here. Yeah, I just want to make sure he only does this. I, I don't care about the other one. I mean, I do care about the other ones, but we don't. It, it takes so long to do this. We might as well just focus on this set. Hey, Fefe. Did you guys woohoo or did that? Did you not? What happened? Oh, yeah, you did. Cool. <laughs> cool. All right, so that's that. Now, I guess oh, I just want to do this, but I don't think I'm going to get to level 10 logic today because we're pretty much done here. We do need to fix or upgrade a few more items, so maybe we can just go do some of that now. I don't know. You've spread over to the wrong, the dark side. Do this one first and this one. No, 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 that one. There you go. And then, no, no, no. Now we fertilize them again because it's run out. All right, so I only had six more super vitality. I guess actually if I clean out some of the animal stuff, we might get some more. Oh no, there's nothing to clean. I think these are super dirty though. Yeah, let's go clean these. Wait, does Hazel have any upgrade parts? She was 34 common. Any plumbing? No. All right, disordered a bunch of parts. So we should be able to do some more upgrades or not. Three, oh wait, what happened? I thought I just gave all the common parts to you. You have 50 sim, wait. Oh, I was on the wrong sim. <laughs> cool, there we go. All right, let's go clean out these. We might get some more super vitality if we're lucky. Mm, no super vitality from that. We've got plenty of regular vitality, which is also good. It's just not quite the same. Uh, Hazel, can I get you to go feed both the cow plants before they eat us? <laughs> How are you going with your nerd brain? Are you gonna do one more upgrade? And then we're just gonna focus on the logic. I also need to give uh, Hagrid a bath too. Because Hagrid is looking rough. Oh, there you go. Look at this, 4,500 points. How good is that? Okay, Vitality Fertilizer, no super vitality. That's okay. All right, let's go over here. We got to fertilize the rest of the... Oh, here comes the water. We got to fertilize the rest of these with just regular vitality. The birds are coming to eat all the bugs. The chickens are golden pulsing. Oh, these... I think these have got to be like huge this time, right? Like this is going to be... This is going to be the best crop we've ever had. 
Hey, Fei Fei. Um, would you, what, uh, you wanna, we can go to walk. Let's go for a walk together. Oh, look, Hazel's waiting for me. Oh, uh, Hazel, I didn't even ask you to do that. That's so nice of you. Do you wanna go join her, Trenton? Oh, Hagrid wants a, a walk too. Okay, you do that then. There you go. All right, so you go for a jog. Ch oh, uh, Ch Ch Chaz, where's Fei Fei? Why do you look so pleased with, the, with yourself? Chaz, where's Fei Fei and why are you so dirty? What did he do with Fei Fei? Ah! <laughs> and I guess on that note, we're gonna leave this part here. Find out if Fei Fei went upstate to the farm somewhere next episode, or if she's still around. I, I don't know why he looks so happy and he's so filthy at the same time. But um, yeah, anyway, so that's good. So next time I'm gonna, we're gonna get uh, Trenton's logic skill all the way up so that we can get the instant upgrades. So we can instant upgrade the animal coop so we can get the auto feeding without the animal shed upgrade parts. Then we can get another chicken coop as well. Also in the comments down below, let me know the renovations and changes we should make to our house to accommodate Hazel. I do think the idea of like a workshop for her, like a creative space for painting and photography is a really good idea. Um, I think we should definitely look into that. Um, and yeah, and other than that, let me know your thoughts and suggestions down below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day.